Yo dog, it's Cannon Man from Rage Quitter, and we're playing a little Tales of Graces F for the PS3, as many of the games I play are, because I like the controller better, so shut up. But, uh, about 21 hours into the game, we're doing a dungeon here, just to give you a little view of the gameplay footage here. As you can see, if you've played Tales games before, <coughs> uh, you'll see that it has followed the formula pretty true. You won't see, you won't see a lot of. I mean, it'll throw some new concepts at you, but it'll seem pretty familiar. You'll be able to jump right into the game, and much as I have, as a big fan of the Tales series, um, goes back to that active battle system as you saw previously. Um, interesting feature about that, though is in this version of the game there is no magic or tech or whatever. You get this little gauge that continuously counts up if you wait and uh, maxes out and you use that to use your technique abilities, which is kind of nice in the regards that you can never run out. You just have to stop attacking for a split second. If you take a look at my guy on the left here, Albel. Let's see, I'm at zero now. I'm going to take a second to wait. It comes up to eight, which allows me to use up my techniques here. And that's particularly handy with any of the mage characters, or specifically the healers, is that as long as they have the the moment away from the enemy, they get that chance to get their spell off. Fight more foes, get more gear. We'll try to keep this video to only about ten minutes, since the last one's gotten kind of long. Whoops. in this lab are pretty strange, aren't they? I've heard that Fendel has been investing in biological weaponry. Perhaps this lab is being used to facilitate it. Watch out, guys. This one... I expect the best from everyone. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
four hit combo that didn't do the job, Jesus Christ. I'm surprised you were able to defeat my Varus. Give this Pascal, what are you doing? Guys, you might want to get back. 